For me as a teacher, I've never been that confident doing the drama side of things. I've done it in English and those kind of things, but seeing the small steps and kind of how to build it up quite quickly through what looks like games into increasing their confidence and getting the children, doing the role play, creating the music in that kind of speedy kind of half hour time period has been really impressive. I did a drama degree, so I would have thought coming into teaching that would be something I would be used to doing and would find easy but actually doing these sessions with Stevie has, has helped me rediscover that and realise that there are so many different ways that you can use drama and, and art in order to access the curriculum. We have an inquiry based curriculum so we have big key questions and we interweave the subjects within that. We try to bring in oracy into that but also try and be creative with our arts. Drama hadn't had a key role up to this point, this was a lovely opportunity for us to then bring drama into our inquiries so that we add that layer of creativity. Yeah, my teachers have been really excited about drama because they celebrate when they know it's Wednesday is drama day. They really celebrate a lot. Our teacher got a bit more creative and made quite funny remarks on purpose and jokes. I think Scott's really thought about um, not just our work but also our well-being and if people are a bit nervous how they can control their emotions and regulate if they need to. That kind of teaching style and looking at how our feelings can change and adapt um, has really really helped my own teaching style in a more, to make me more nurturing. For myself as a teacher I've started planning in more activities, more ways that the children can explore a topic without just listening to facts and repeating them or, or kind of learning things off memory. The PSHE games that we've done, they kind of made me think differently they made me think how those things happen in real life and it just demonstrates that without it having to happen. Seeing the teachers really take that on board and run with that idea and starting to use it on a day-to-day -day basis now has just been fantastic. I think that sort of looseness is really nice to see teachers going, we can do this creative project and we might not know how it's going to and we'll, get, you know, we'll see where it goes and I, I think that's been really lovely. For a lot of the children, they don't think about the positivity within themselves, but this project is definitely helping with that. The confidence and resilience of the children has really taken a dip over the Covid period. They need to know that they're okay and they're going to be okay and their place in the world is important, that they matter being present in a room is important and that they can make a change, however small, to someone's day. The um, students are like listening to the teacher and the teacher's like helping them build up. It has made me feel happy because I have um, never did this before and it's nice to um, do something new. I think it's really good because it's fun. I was just like one of those people who are quite nervous, but it definitely boosted my confidence. I feel really calm when I do it and like relax. I saw lots of sides of children I didn't know existed. I feel proud that I'm actually like joining in with like stuff like proper joining in and actually enjoying it. There's been like hundreds of things that have inspired me. I would describe it really fun, like that is the best session I've ever done. Um, I, can you guys come back more?